CEO of BioMarin told shareholders Tuesday the company will not grant compassionate use. And we believe that everybody, all the patients that we try to serve should have access to the drug in an absolutely equal way. No one has priority over anybody else. And, um, and, and consequently, we will continue to stay true to that purpose. No life is worth more than the other. No one person deserves this drug more than the other. Um, I just happen to be the person who's asking for it right now. BioMarin's chief medical officer, Dr. Henry Fuchs, spent close to an hour telling shareholders about the promising results the company has seen in 673 trials. 673 is far more potent than anything else we've looked at in terms of the park uh, space, and it's very active. We think that this drug is going to grow legs. And then a question from the audience. Could you please comment on the possible effects of stock prices and shareholders of the negative press as a result of Andrea Sloan's failed request for compassionate use of BMN 673 and whether any potential litigation would cause a dip in prices? Hope sometimes gets unfulfilled in the course of clinical trials and uh, things that we think work don't actually end up working. In fact, uh, more harm can be done. So we stick to the clinical trials process. 673 is far more potent than anything else we've looked at in terms of the park uh, space and it's very active. We think that this drug is going to grow legs. You know, our objective is to uh, get the drugs we are developing to the maximum number of patients in the minimum amount of time. And um, that's what we are focusing on. But an email obtained by KXAN shows BioMarin may be focused on more than that. The company's CEO appears to have accidentally replied all in a response to an Andrea Sloan supporter. In his email, the CEO writes to Fuchs and other executives, quote, Hank, as you said, it's time to refocus the message on competitive PARPs available. Although, is the assertion that there are no trials of PARP inhibitors currently enrolling in ovarian cancer correct? Deborah, have you engaged the PR agency? BioMarin's media spokesperson, Deborah Charlesworth, responded, we don't have any further comment.